Mark, concrete, sort of a universal building material, cheap, easy to work with, but not great to look at. Right. So that's why I like to use a masonry stain. Stain, not paint? Stain, not paint. Uh, the stain is going to actually penetrate the surface, and the added advantage of using a stain is there's a waterproofing agent built right into it. So we're going to make it look better, but we're going to protect it as well. Exactly. Okay. What would you do to prep the surface? So all we did very simply was, if you have a power washer, get a power washer clean that right up. If you don't have a power washer, we're going to use a bucket, a scrub brush, scrub it as hard as we can, let it dry, and apply the stain. All right, let's apply the All stain. Right. This is water-based? Water-based. Regular brush? Regular brush. Regular brush strokes? Regular brush strokes. So at this point, we're just painting any old surface, right? Uh, nothing more to it than that. And uh, I don't know, was that brown or beige or something? Is this one of three colors they offer to choose from? Well, another great advantage of this stain is a bunch of years ago, that's what it was, four or five colors. Now if you bring a chip in, they can mimic any color that you have. No way. Like, so you yeah. go to the paint department with a chip and they mix? Paint department of any hardware store is going to be well equipped to take care of any color. It looks like you're getting pretty good coverage. Yeah. Are you a one coat guy or do you think uh, two coats is necessary? You know what? Uh, this is actually newer concrete, so you're going to get less pull, less absorption. Something a little older, you may have to do two coats, but as you can see for this uh, application right now, we're doing great with one coat. That's awesome. Yeah. Well, you can really dress up any of it. I mean, there's a lot of concrete walls out there that That's just look right. kind of drab. Yeah. They usually will match the color of a house uh, or not and use the foundation color as an accent, but we're seeing a lot of it both commercially and residentially right now. And if I have an unfinished interior basement, um, I presume I can do this on the interior side of the foundation as well as the outside? Yeah, this is not just an exterior only. You can use it inside uh, or outside. Oh, that looks great. There's a lot of drab concrete walls that are about to get uh, spruced up. Oh yeah, this is the way to do it. Looks good, thanks. Thanks, Kevin. I won't tell Mario you're cheating on him. Good. Thanks for watching. This old house has got a video for just about every home improvement project, so be sure to check out the others. And if you like what you see, click on the subscribe button. Make sure that you get our newest videos right in your feed.